again, welcome back to XCOM 2 Legendary Iron Man Exquisite Timing, the second attempt. My name is Saiken and I am inviting you back to the second part of our mission. Uh, for those of you who have missed the first part, go back and uh, watch it, but a short summary. We essentially have uh, positioned ourselves here up in the ledge. There are four chrysalids left. I suspect one to be here because he bored and probably around the rest around uh, the gate because they usually are around the gate. So that's our first priority. Secondly, we got uh, the eyeball, the gatekeeper, as well as, oh, look at that, three chrysalids here. So plus one around here, which makes four. So we got the gatekeeper here and uh, the chosen as the last one. Let's get our uh, borrowed in chrysalid out. Whenever they bug in, you force them to bug out. There we go. That's the right move. Can we get it? Yes, we can. Yes, man. Moving, out. Moving up. Overwatch. Overwatch. Gonna okay. go to the ledge. If Obi Wan can Obi taught you anything, then you gotta it. stay on the high ground, Anakin. Triggering sure. the eyeball now. Not a big thing. It will just stay there. The for starters, we gotta deal with the chrysalids though. They are a bit more dangerous at the moment. Good. Overwatch, 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 Overwatch. Let's go. Good. That worked out pretty well. Well, mostly, of course, hitting is, uh, as per the usual, not working very well. Well, we almost got it down. That's good. Like it. Good. Um, hey, we're just going to get the kill, I suppose. Not sure if she got promoted yet. I think so, but I'm not sure. Can't fully remember. Okay. Soon the zombies are going to come in. So we definitely want to take care of uh, those. Moving, on target location. Moving up. Overwatch. Reload. Overwatch. Overwatch. Let's get him up here. Oh, we got a remote start. Okay, well, never mind, I suppose. Those remote starts will not help us. Good, let's try to kill all of the spectre zombies. Nice hit. Kill. Perfect. I'll get him next time. Uh, that was unfortunately pretty bad.
Good, we're all moving back. And can we get a Chris of it? Yes, we can. They are pretty far away, so we should be okay, nevertheless. I will go. Let's soften them up just a tiny bit more. Alright, overwatch, overwatch, and overwatch. Wow, okay, that's pretty far away. Good. Four starters. Let's get a parrying blocker up here. So he's essentially going to be the one who is taking the heat after they are coming in. Heading out. Going to high ground. Sure, we could kill that guy. Good, let's reload and get the last crystal down. Let's kill that last chrysalis. There we go. Continuing to build up the Soul Reaper stack. Reloading. And Pistol Overwatch. It's definitely going for the uh, for the Templar. Nice little parry. That should teach you a lesson. Next turn we're going to see more zombies. Alright, reload. Hit this guy and then we're finishing it with our Reaper. So that we can overwatch again. Getting a little bit closer just to make sure that we're having that 100%. Don't want to lose our concealment due to a 6% marginality. Very nice. Reload Overwatch. Getting closer over here where I want to place the sniper. For the zombies, we're going to take another Overwatch. And yet again, some more zombies. So we killed four chrysalids. 
This is all taking longer than I would have anticipated. Gosh. That ability to, uh, to continue to spawn zombies, no, regardless where we are, it's just infuriating. I mean, yes, tracking short is also not nice. It is a pain to work against. But at least for the tracking shot, it feels like only one person is affected. These guys, it always is everyone. Uh, who's affected. There we go, we just got the promotion, perfect. Make sure we get into a really nice solid position. Maintaining this area. So we want to deal with the Destroy big fat eye next us. turn. Or probably the turn after next turn. Double checking, yep, that would hit him. Because if we can double frag, that essentially would shred him completely. Good, so what? where are we going? What else? Gotta get some solid cover over here. No, I think we're fine. On the move. Sona needs to get over here. On your order. All right, Hayward. Also full cover. As far as I'm concerned, next turn we're going to go in. Reloading if possible. Oh, yeah. Overwatching. Chosen doesn't do anything, which is great. It's out of line of sight. Now, let's start, shall we? I'll leave this here. This should shred almost all of its armor. It's unfortunately going to reveal us 100% of the time. Very nice. Still worth it. Down to two. Pretty aggressive movement, all things considered. Let's make sure that we're shredding it a hundred percent. Gotta get rid of its armor. Gotta do it fast. Good. It is shredded. That's the good news. Bad news is it's probably going to be difficult to get it down.
owns take C8 protocol. It's a miss. Lightning hand to soften it up. Not enough crit. This thing is sturdy. Six points of damage is exactly what we're looking for. How do you get closer with the shotgun? There's no way around it. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. nice. Okay. Four to seven. That's a good chance of actually killing it. a bit closer to maybe increase our chances of hitting it. Six percent, twenty percent is better, so let's get up here. Very nice. I think we can get it. All right, vaulting. Perfect. Didn't even need to deal with the uh, backlash of an explosion. He's part of us. Hopefully not. It's on the edge. We're just on the edge. That's one of the chosen. Mm, no. Yes, but oh. oh, I would love to have a mind shield. How I would absolutely love to have a mind shield. Luckily enough, we have a revival protocol. The next attack, by the way, for those of you who are unaware, will be mind control. So we got got to be careful. Okay, so how do we deal with the chosen? I'd like to suggest that we're getting out of uh, line of sight and letting him come to us. But first things first. Let's actually hit this thing. Can't become invisible again. Uh, we certainly don't want to charge in. 
we would like to go further back. Yep, that we're, we're not seen. Overwatch. Overwatch. Out of line of sight, fully out of line of sight, but still in a good spot to trigger and or come back. Overwatch. Another Overwatch. Another Overwatch. So yes, that thing is going to regenerate, but at the same time, we have a lot of Overwatches on our side. Nice. Almost got it down. There we go. My expectations for them were exceedingly low. Great. Good. Will this edict is clear. You will return to them, Commander. So he will mind control um, as an ex as an ex action, which isn't too bad if we can offer him the demolition so the grenadier if his magazine is empty and we're out of line of sight that's not bad either so first and foremost get him Okay, secondly, still has three armor, which is difficult to deal with. We need to shred it, but I don't have any explosion other than our grenadier now that's He has a pretty serious defense overall. All things considered, he actually has a pretty serious defense. I'm hoping for bewildering wounds. Because this shit here is going to go downhill. If we're not finding a better way to deal with him. So that's one hit. That's the second one. another Alarium core that's great let's hope he's not taking our um, Templar sometimes the tech is the best defense and the one thing that we're doing here is we're essentially trying to just burst him down That. that would have been a great hit. Okay, so maybe he's not uh, mind controlling, but he will most probably. Another mind sport. Okay, cool. That's not bad. 
do that. And we resisted it. Holy shit. Very nice. Still cannot remote start him. He is now going to, like, bit by bit, start to move further back. I already know that. It's, uh, it's a technique that he loves to employ. So he will probably try to get even deeper in. And that's fine, we're committed at this point. Nice critical hit, good job. move over, flank us, take a shot, don't want to do that, so we're continuing to stay in cover. Still can't get rid of his armor, not yet. Just to get a better shot uh, shooting angle. It's probably going to mind control. Play our cards right though. Ooh, no. That's not the worst. That is not the worst. We can deal with a spectral army. Six points of damage, that's good. Let's see, what else do we have? We got the night li nice little lightning hands. There we go. On your order. Moving up. Uh, can we hit someone? Not a great chance, but I will hit. Perfect. Things are going our way. I like it. Good. So much for the spectral army, which I was hoping that was almost best case. Eat dirt, dirt hat. Uh, he graced that, of course. That will not be enough. I loaded these cards Gotta reload, the so can't just chase endlessly. Nice, that crit was good. Are we going to finish it? Come on.
He is almost down. He is almost down. Now the mine scorch. So close. Okay, come on, come on. We're almost there. There we go. Let's go. Let's go, boys. Perfect. We got the Warlock down. And that's five ability points on top of it. Mwah. Past the gateway, secure. Wow, that was a battle. If that hadn't been a close one, I don't know what would end really overall pretty well. Alright, we're back. Well, that is great. We got a lot of promotions. Bravely Wounded sucks, but uh, with the necessary uh, healing and we're going to heal for a lot, we are going to be fine. Let's first of all do the promotion. So I think we're going to go for face off because realistically kill zone wouldn't be as great as an ability for her threat assessment all the way. Finally. What do we want? Oh nice. Shredder on top of it. And banish. Are you serious? And an additional claymore. Well, that's a difficult choice. Luckily, I don't need to take difficult choices. We can have it all. We can have it all. Look at that, guys. Uh, banish plus Shredder plus another uh, mine. He just became a beast. So Deflect, certainly something to consider. Still no Blade uh, from Storm. Too bad. Yeah, we're going to go for the, uh, the Deflect route. And Richter doesn't trigger. I think I can't select it. Okay. Whatever that is, I'll do it in a second. Good. We got the psionic gate. Wait. gateway of some kind. Although we believe it. New objective added. In order to analyze Perfect. the alien now all of the things will come together. We will need to make the appropriate modifications to the shadow chamber first. Command. Let's upgrade it. Insufficient power. Four power. Okay. Where do we get the power from? Let's see. Can't get any more power here. Already got two people staffed. Let me check something. What happens if I'm decommissioning the Guerrilla Tactic School? Do I keep the updates? Okay, I informed myself and apparently if you uh, cancel the GTS, you also suppress uh, all of the upgrades that uh, came with it, which means, believe it or not, the only thing that we can actually get rid of is the resistance ring. We don't have, we can't afford to lose more days, so I gotta do it right now. Engineering, build facilities, There we go. What we would want to do now is we want to upgrade the Psionic Gate. Shadow Chamber upgraded. And whilst we're at it, got three more um, to go. And 
let's build proving grounds it's 28 days 14 if we're um, halving, halving it that is good enough we can do that so i'm going on with our plan to continue to build the proving ground we don't have any capacity to spare which means we can't expand our facilities further good all right so we can start researching the sonic gate let me uh, gateway let me fix that real quick uh, we're going to go to the black market and do a bit of a salary do all right so we figured out how to deal with the supply situation black market definitely worked out well whilst i'm here let's just see we also can do the normal supply drop uh, the normal supply uh, supply drop sorry um, gathering we if we expand our queue we only take nine days which is less than i thought but that's great in june we're going to be done with the gate we can then switch redo it and um, do the next one the last one the avatar corpse uh, that's another 10 days Mwah, very good um gut plated armor maybe even as an option which would be awesome and for now i think we're just gathering the supplies because it's 16 more days until we get some that'll hopefully be enough for all of our efforts Perfect. Supplies are done. We need to go to heal faster, which is what we're going to do for the rest of that run. Just to get everyone back. I am not yet sure how to deal with the option here. We still got one factory, theoretically. If I should go for that or not. Let me check something. Yeah, upon reflection, we do have the option to go for it, but it would also unleash one of the alien rulers. Maybe we're getting someone killed or gravely injured. Yeah. I'm so close to maybe pulling this off. I don't want to take any risks. I'm glad to see our joint effort paid off like we hoped. Perfect. One of my best people was so impressed by your soldiers after that last action together. They're coming to join Good. We can't them. take any more covert actions, clearly, because we're not having that option anymore. Ooh, wait a second. Maybe we can. Not sure why I can even do that, but... Do we have a short run? Damage output of pistols plus one. That is good. That is damn good. Do we want another skirmisher maybe? 50 days? <laughs> Gain ability points isn't bad either. I like the health. Yeah, realistically speaking, that's probably the best. Now nah, it takes a scientist away. Nope, that's a no no. Recruit skirmisher. That's a sergeant. Do we have anyone whom we can spare? Now, a new reaper. Elders twist reality to allow their armies to pass through from worlds they have already conquered. This gateway is one of many, and it presents a great danger to us all. Let's promote a soldier real quick. Remote start, yes. Shrapnel, yes, and that's it. Pretty straightforward. We, I forgot. 
we got another promotion and there we go good so on our operation i like the breakthrough research but not with a required scientist 15 ability points isn't bad Yeah, let's take the skirmisher and Sane and him go on to that mission. Fair enough. My kind will do whatever is needed. Good. So, in terms of further events, six more days until we get the psionic gate. Okay. Then we need the Shadow Chamber, uh, research for the Avatar, and that is it. Got our next uh, potential missions. Another Engineer. Not bad. 200 supplies. Not worth it. 80 into... What would we do with another engineer? When a cover civilians present in the zone can be contacted to gain valuable rewards. Hmm. Unknown enemy. All right. Unknown enemy. All right. Unknown enemy. So we're going to fight against the chosen again. I'll figure out how we want to deal with that for now that's the end of uh, the session we got to deal with that one more mission and maybe it's a good option for us to gain some more experience so not a bad idea to begin with overall prior to the end of the months we're going to be done uh, with that psionic gate which is great then we only need the avatar and yeah, depending on how much more time is uh, available for the plated armor we uh, might be getting that as well good news is i'm actually quite happy about the proving ground and how all of that has turned out in the end um, so towards the end of uh, or yeah a little bit into the next month proving grounds uh, will go up i oh, we do have enough supplies that's absolutely fantastic we need to be really, really careful of what we're dealing, uh, doing with the supplies. But yeah, I think we can pull it off. Just don't need to trip now. Um, one more uh, mission. Then I think it's almost all the way uh, to, to the end. Getting the team ready, getting all of uh, the items ready. Yeah, and then the biggest portion will be the last mission or three chosen. I haven't eliminated a single one. Uh, and god forbid the last uh, room will be horribly difficult yeah well whatever i'll figure it out as we go thank you so much for watching if you enjoyed what you've seen uh, hit that big fat thumbs up and a like button uh, and leave a comment down below and see you in the next um, episode bye bye